So the first thing we should always do is set up uh, a project to be working from. So I'm going to quickly run through setting up an inventor project, which would save a .ipj file. So the first thing we do is up here in the ribbon, click on projects. Now there will be a, a few projects preloaded. As you can see, I've set a few up here for reverse engineering and TS test and things like that. But I'm going to start a new one, uh, and whatever you're highlighted on it will copy th the... Um, the properties that are saved here. So I'm going to copy this default one. So if I hit new, it will ask you if you want to set up a single user project or a vault project. For this we'll be doing a single user project. So in the project name I'm going to put world skills regional example. It then asks where you would like to start saving this. So I've actually created a folder on the desktop called world skills regional example. So I'm going to go into there. You then hit next and you can see what what projects you've got here and the new project. So you want to copy the libraries that you're using. So if you have, say, for example, more than one library, you can you can choose to use all or some of them in your project. But we don't need to do any of that, so I'm going to go finish. Uh, and then you will see World Skills Regional Example, and because it's ticked, that's the current project we're going to be using. So if you select done, and that should be your project set up. And if you go into the actual folder, you can see here uh, Windows Explorer, and you can see there's actually a .ipj called WorldSkills 